Hey everyone, welcome to the new video series of Azure DevOps. In this video series, I am going to post 30 videos in 30 days. In this video, what we are going to see is templates. I'm going to explain in which scenario you can use template. Not to do that, just go to work item under bots and you can select any type of work item you want. I'm going with user story. So for every user story, I need to have business unit. I need to say which business unit it belongs to and business contact meaning like what is the email id of the particular business and is this user story is depend upon os whether it is windows linux whether this particular user story implementation is depending upon os s or no and similarly for acceptance criteria i need to have this particular line in every acceptance criteria what i'm going to do is i'm going to capture this items as a template so that when i'm creating a new story i can simply copy it so let me show how so in order to do it, I'm not going to save this user story. Simply just click on this more action and under templates, just click on capture. And what it does is it will just list out whatever the field it is already filled up. Let's say for example, acceptance criteria, description, priority. So these and all gets filled. Do we need to copy this priority as well? No, I don't want this priority, reason, state, value. These I don't want. All we need is just these two fields. and under which team we need so simply just select any team you want i'm just saving it under sales team and what is the name of the template you want to provide i have provided a name to the template so let me click on save and let me close it let me get back to work item and now let's create a user story now and this time what i'm going to do is i'm going to use the existing template which we have saved so simply tab this three dot templates and here we could find our template so let me select this and here you could see automatically what are the value we have saved in the template it automatically copied over here so this is the scenario where you can use templates and where these templates will get saved in case if i want to delete a template how can i do so so what in order to do it just go to project setting and under that navigate to team configuration because we have saved under sales team right so let me select sales team from here and under the templates so we have saved a template for user story right just select this and we could find it here in case if you want to edit it or delete it you can do so from here similarly you can create multiple templates for user story as well as for other type of work item as well can i apply this template to the existing work items yeah we can do so let me show how so simply navigate to backlogs or you can create queries as well. Let me go to backlog and let me switch to sales team. And these are the existing user story. It doesn't have any value. So let me select multiple. Just click on control and select multiple item and click on the three dot. And here you could find templates. Just simply select it. And now let's cross verify. Yeah, it got copied. Not only that, even though we have say, saved the template under sales team, we could use for other team as well. So let me select other team. And for this as well, I'm going to select template. And that's it. Yeah, the template got copied to this user story as well. And that's it on this video. We have a lot of concepts to cover. I request you to hit the bell icon. Then only you will get a notification whenever I'm uploading new videos. I'll be providing the WhatsApp and Telegram channel URL in the video description. Please do join. Follow me on LinkedIn to stay connected. Thank you. Bye-bye.